Welcome back to the Upturned, part two. Bring hmm. the doors. All right, cool. Floor 133. I forgot I was playing this thing for a while last time, so. I say last time, but as you can see, um, this is right off the last playthrough. Welcome to the Upturned Public Library. Okay. Should be a light switch in this room somewhere. Yes, it is quite dark. Oh. Right here? Yeah. Hot door. Statue man again. I'm not going this. Cleaning supplies. Uh, oh. Hey, there. Alright, hello everybody, and welcome back to The Upturned. What a wonderful video. Fuck you. Sorry about that, sir. I'm just testing the PA system. No reason in particular. Okay, so what's next then? There's a locked door around here somewhere. <laughs> Everything here is a weapon. Just FYI. I like this book right here. This crow right here that I just killed, I'll kill the other crow with it. Okay, you done? Cool. That door. You see, we have a vast selection of, uh, of, uh, oh, the shelves are empty. Mmm, you have some explaining to do, buddy. No matter, you shouldn't read too much anyway, it's bad for your teeth, but... I love reading. Manga enthusiast over here. Y'all, I found it! The fire exit! Is it real or is it a mimic? It's... fake. So for those of you who don't know, this game is designed by the developer that made Lethal Company. And one of the mods in Lethal Company... Makes it to where the fire exits can be fake, and then you, when you try to open them, you get eaten by a giant monster. <clears throat> okay, when I pick up this key, shit's gonna happen, right? Got the key. Just gonna get crazy now. No. In this box, right? All right, Lawrence. There you
Man, look at all these Lawrences on the floor. That guy is vicious. Not that. Yes. I want them all. Honestly, so I don't... I'll... Um, I'm only gonna take one with me. Again, Lawrence, really? Very nice about the midkits, I don't even have to secure them. Oh boy. Doors open, no care. They're going to die. I'm a brutal murderer. <laughs> Thanks for your time. Gonna take these with me, just in case you never know. It hits the fan and all. Taking just two. There, now I have like eight in here. Ah, oh, God. At the door. W. Why? Why are you giving me a W? Why is it negative? Okay, where are we stopping in at? Mmm, looks like 150. Damn it. 152? Don't you dare. 151? 154. Alright. 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 make kids on backup. Bed for a day now. I know where this is going.
Let's see what was in there. Damn. Got it, but I can't leave yet. Need that chocolate bar. Crazy bastard. I. Okay, where is that other chocolate bar at? I think I know. I don't want to know, but I think I know. First door. That we can't get to. Um, know where that is, right? All right. I go. I don't know what that's for, but. Please move that box out of the way. Thank you. Thanks. Tensing situations. Is that always open? Sailing, what do you want? Would you like to hear some tunes which I have made myself? Okay. Sure. Yes, sir, you're the best. I'll play it over the intercom so you can hear all the all, all the bass. Alright, now we're talking. about my tune. It was wonderful. Yes, I think I've, I've perfected my craft. <laughs> oh, by the by, the by, I was wearing headphones, but I believe I heard thrashing. Splashing and horse screaming on the phone line. I assume everything is, is, is okay? Yes. Great, just great, just as I thought. I'm sure your unexpected and lengthy tour of my hotel has proven to you just how much we strive for a quality experience here in the afterlife. I'm dead. Just for, for note, how would you rate your experience so far? Five stars. Thank you. I am not surprised, of course, five stars. I expected no less. That was great. Oh, the guy's funny. <sighs> so what's this way? Did I ever go this way? No, I didn't. What? Oh, it's a circular. I. What are you doing here, sir? Know oh, what you're doing here? Unlocked bonus floor X. Rated R plus. It's rated R, everybody. Rated R. Shrimp. A mystery of fate, espionage, and shrimp. Do I get to be sneaky now? Three, four, five, six. It's increasing. Oh, 169. Seven, you missed an opportunity there. 
Opening the, the Zors. You didn't think I'd catch that? Mm. What you got for me this time? So far, you've been keeping me entertained. Never know if I'll need that. God. It was bound to happen eventually. Somebody called Mark Blair. Power here. That would turn on all of the lights and stuff, but just the one room. I think I pick it up. Yay. No. I want to play the games. No, let me let me let me play them. Oh, it's a lock on. But I don't want to leave the game room. Yes, racy racers. Ah, secrets. Is this one playable? He won't start. Why? Hmm. Oh no. Have I broken it. Which one of you hold the secrets? Where's the secrets? Yes, it must be done. Um. I want the game start. Must be done. Alright. I restarted. Because... I want to play this little game. But it's not working. There must be a secret to it. Which I do not know. I spent 10 minutes on that, I'm not even lying. 10 minutes. I wanted to play a game within a game. Let's open all the doors. Let all of the things out. Give me the money. Left, right, left, right. Ah, the weightlifting center. Ground floor. Oh. This is a bigger area than I expected. That upper floor, it looks like upper. Ah, they're making me go in circles. Circles. I'll take my head off. I can't take my head off.
key poster. Oh shit. Wait. Everything's fully powered now. What does that mean? I don't know, the game is still unplayable. Dads! Break down the damn wall. Hello? Going for the chair, but okay. Jado, do you need any help? Sure. Oh, okay, good. Have you found the power plug for the elevator? No. Alright, when you find it, you have to return to the elevator and plug it in, and you'll... Ha, ah, who am I kidding? That thundercloud outside is blistering again. I really just called you because I was ever so slightly afraid. It's never been so empty in the lobby. It almost sounds like the storm I was under when I died. How did you die? Man, I shouldn't have brought that up. Let me think. <clears throat> I mean, you, er you opened the curtain for that, so... What oh, birds? I was hoping it was very dangerous. Okay, Mr. Doll, I'll tell you how I died, but first you have to tell me what happened to you. I don't know. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Wait, what? What do you mean? Did you get sick? F fell off a cliff? Got stabbed? Took a bullet? Become alligator poop, or, or you don't want to say? No, I don't know. That's a terrible mystery. What's the last thing you remember doing? Checking the after the cooking beans and rice. <laughs> uh, for me, it's reading an old magazine. Maybe returning the pages gave you a paper cut that gave you sepsis, which spread to your brain and killed you instantly before you could even react. Unless it's clear, you shouldn't read old magazines, Mr. Doe. I don't think that's it. Oh. We have to get to the bottom of this, sir. I won't rest until we know what killed you, and then I still won't rest because we can't sleep in the afterlife. I'm going to see if I can find any records. Okay. Where is this abomination? Don't float. Didn't need the TNT after all. Why does that look like an upper floor? <clears throat> It is. The medicans.
Run. Shit. I knew it. God, so I die. That was only good. I was ready for that. So they keep, yeah, they keep walking. I think I just saw him get right to the door. Yep. Yeah. Oh, there's a chocolate bar here. Shit. I don't know what the chocolate bar is. There's like a. Maybe there's just like a collectible or something. <clears throat> My 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 room's in the thousands, sir. This is a problem. Oh, sorry, I, I forgot to mute. Between the doors. For 182. Interesting. So the floor never got quite finished. Construction, ha, huh? sorry about that. Fire exit.
Hit. I have a status report, sir. What? Search and search and found something called the Complete Historic Database. It has information on every soul that lives on Earth, including you and I. Well? <clears throat> well, it's seriously locked down. Don't even have clearance to request access to the files. What then? So, of course, I dove into the deep web and hired someone who could impersonate high clearance personnel and get me access. I don't know. This news is breaking. This news is breaking. All I know is I'm going to find out how you died. So do one way or another. I'll tell you when something else happens. Hey, well, now I don't need to hold down the button to hold this thing anymore. But now I do. I turned you off. You're still doing it. Sassy shit. Goodbye, water room. Going to complete chapter two. You. What are the chocolate bars for, anyway? Seven. Six or one five. Opening the snores. Or one ninety five. Hmm. Oh, that we ordered metal detectors for security reasons, but there was a misunderstanding. But it only lets through things that are 100% metal. Other objects have to go through the side apparatus. Coincidentally, it also lets through a big form of plastic. plastic. Any lint and ash I've run some tests. It's very scientific. Are you surprised you can walk through it? Hmm. Really, you didn't think we kept our bodies when we, when we died? No, we're not made of metal. I thought we'd know we're made of ash and ash life, just judging by the smell. Huh. You notice how your soldiers crumble away if you scratch it? And why do you think your stomach never rumbles? At least we're not made of pocket land, right? I suppose. Am I to... Am I... Ah, I have to get back to... Get a little... Mm -hmm. Minor inconvenience. They catch with the dad I've never had. Yay! Destruction. Uh. 
Ah, uh, this is destructive. couple of hours. Hmm. Sure thing, sir. That only took several minutes. Even. Whatever piece of heavy furniture, I think I would like to be tossed into a spring. Actually, I had a dream about that once. Really now? Really now? Fuse is a object, right? Oh, no. okay. Fair enough. I have a fuse. Don't have a key. <clears throat> Check a bar. Number two. Do I care enough? Really? Hold up. I have an idea. Okay, never mind. Opens that one. <clears throat> I got one chocolate bar. I just survive what they attract. <clears throat> even non my object by adultering physics structures in a way that science thought it possible they may be, even be intelligent. I meant to get. How dare you? It's where we were before. Really? 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 Right there? Yes. I got access to the complete historic database. Database. I'm a high clearance official now, but not really. Some nerd from the deep web just hacked to get me in. 
The website looks like it was built in 1893. Is that what all top secret databases look like? So, I thought that was it. And I'd be able to find out what caused your death, but now I have to request the documents to be faxed. So I ordered a fax machine for my supplier, and the fax machine arrived. It's cute colored. It looks like it runs on a gas engine, because it literally does. It's a good thing I collected some ga gasoline tanks as a hobby, or I'd have to order that too. You sure that's a fax machine? Absolutely. Well, anyways, I set everything up. Then I remembered the, uh, the upturned in doesn't have any phone lines. The fax machine's not going to work. I'll admit it. I don't know what to do, Mr. Doe. There must be something. What's happening? Something from outside smashed through the window of the lobby. Through my beautiful windows. Rock. Sounds like more than just a rock, man. I don't know. I'm hiding. There's a light shining over the desk. It's moving around a lot. It's like a flare. And the air smells like boiled eggs. Scratch that. Now it smells like root beer flavored candy. I hate root beer flavored candy. What? Am I sorry, sir? I'm going to have to put you on hold. And this is your fault. Just so we're clear. It is your fault. Out. I, I'm taking this with me. Just to hear you. I am taking... You know what? Stay right there. Because the grabbing physics should be in such a weird... No! It's gonna be mine! Aha! Screw you. Part of my collection. Look complete, and I stole your medkit. That was his fault, just so we're clear. Now we're in the 200s. Chapter 2 is very long. Do it. Alright. Ah, uh, I didn't even speak. Oh, he probably will. Probably hiding and stuff. Huh? Uh... Am I supposed to run into that? <laughs> Excuse me. Can I make it go the way? Thanks. Ooh. 
all of you. I know you're all my enemies. Okay. Just in case, I don't know if I'll need these. Throw them to the other side, man. Might not have a way back. As I thought. Yeah, I can go back, cool. Another one, damn it. Cool. Candy bows. Can't pick them up. They're too heavy. It's gone blue now. Now they're all going to come to life, aren't they? Do it. Called it. Called it. Do I remember where the exit is? Hmm. Oh god. with me. Ha-ha! Always have an escape ready. I took a lot more damage there if I didn't. Five minutes. Ow. Good enough. W plus. Hey, it's a plus this time instead of a minus. Is our friend okay? 
hotel guy. Two to two. Noted. Yeah. Hello, hello. Who are you? You will learn of me soon. What happened to Ik? Maybe did for all I know. Hello, hello. Ik, no. Actually. Wow, that was a great timing. A bit too fast. Fifty, are you? Ah, no. Two fifty. Yes. I'm back. What happened? After I hung up the phone on you, I listened a little longer as that thing moved around the lobby. I heard it panting, and I could hear some kind of clatter on the marble floor. So I thought, of course it must only be be a very unusual breed of dog. And I realized something else. What kind of hotel manager hides from a potential guest? You can't spell business without bravery. Oh, yeah, something like that. So I stood up and looked over the desk at the strange creature. That's when a thousand images flashed through my eyes all in two seconds. Or if you do the numbers, that's 500 images in a second. Or in a second. I thought I was dying, but then I remembered I'm already dead. And the images weren't like memories, but maybe like some kind of incredibly fast. He's a trailer for a movie I'll never see. Then I said the best course of action was to curl up and in the fetal position for 15 minutes, which I promptly did so. I'm sure you had a good time. I mean, yeah. Yes. Ah, just as I expected. Trust me, sir. Your luxury suite on 1434 would be the best part. Anyway, it seemed like that strange being might never leave the lobby. Then I got an idea. I reach for the drawer on my desk where I keep the dog treats. I've seen lots of dogs. But the dog treats are... I just like the taste, okay? But I figured I could give one up if it meant befriending this large, terrifying creature. So I showed him my eyes and stood up with the treat. I said, here, you want a, want a snack? And the treat was torn out of my hand before I knew it. And there was a loud swoon shattering. I opened my eyes and the thing was gone. I think it might have been more like a bird than a dog, but I think it was both. So now what? Well, it smashed through the other window of the lobby on its way out, so now I have two windows to replace. What about my death? Ah, I almost forgot to mention, there's a big fat box on my desk. 
I can only assume it was left here for me by the bird dog thing. So maybe it was like a giant carrier pigeon from hell. Bugs look like it looks like any other old box, but this one has a special label. It says classified from the king's age to the to the two children in a trench coat. Do you think that means it's those top secret daco? Sure. Yes, that's what I was thinking. If we're right, this box should contain a complete account of all history that was has ever unfolded up to the present time, and we should be able to find out what killed you. This box is covered in slime. I think it's slobber of the bird dog thing, and I'm not touching that. But then, I ordered gloves. They should be arriving shortly. Come on. There, there, Mr. Dow. I also want to know how you died, and this box of classified documents surely hides the answer, but we can't be too hasty. I'll update you when I open it safely. Opening the doors. Floor 250. This might be my last one. Oh, how lucky you are to have stopped at Floor 250. That's the art museum. Alright. Charts. Do you appreciate the hard work that went into the exquisite, these exquisite pieces? Mm-hmm. Fun. Fun for the whole family. Uh, please don't pay attention to the sounds on the floor above you. Please focus on the beautiful art, sir. I went into a circle. Preemptively. Collection. I am collecting. Right side up, youth. What? Oh. Abstract. Abstract. I'm actually trying to look at these arts here. The dark prints. Abstract 8. Okay. Hmm. So many rooms. Am I going the right way since it started making noise? Portrait, portrait. Ah, oh, it's genius. Typical configuration. Rare vase. <laughs> Teapot. Oh. Where are you? Abstract. Key. Athletic object. Terrifying.
Groovy. Goodbye. How many floors have I done? This game is addicting. I have to stop. Great team, of course. Of course. Let's see what floor we're stopping on. Hey, let's go this boat. Okay. Seventy. Just your chance again. Go take a look. This is for next time. Whenever I come back to this game. Uh, wait, isn't that the uh, asylum? Hear that? This is the asylum. So if you want to see more, like, comment, and subscribe because this game's really fun. But uh, I'm stopping here. So. Bye bye. But man, did the creator of Lethal Company make a great game before that was even known? Oh boy.